So the Pope, welcome to the great United States of America today. After leaving Cuba, he went to Cuba first, sweltering in the heat for the last three days. <laughs> but, was, that, was that the first time in Cuba as well? Yeah, this new Pope, that was his first time in Cuba. Does, does the Pope normally go to Cuba? Different. Well, I know with, I guess, Castro's brother being in office now, I guess, you know, because like, at one point, you know, Cuba was the enemy, so. Yeah. Yeah, we'll continue, I apologize. Yeah, but he said that this trip to Cuba was not a political trip, so he was not going to speak on the U.S. embargo with Cuba. However, <clears throat> he said it was more of a pastoral trip, but he's coming to the U.S. and he's actually going to go in front of Congress, which is the first pope to do that, to address the joint Congress this week. I think it's Thursday, they said. So. Somehow, when he went to Cuba, it was pastoral. Now that he's in the United States, it's become political. Does that speak to our country at all? <laughs> got all these little black kids. Oh my God, let me, let me, let me rub your elbow and wipe your sweat and touch your feet. What, 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 what? So why are you black people out there? You, that, 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 that would put me into the beginning. Like what? That's like that. Not that many. Several. In nah. fact, they said there's 70 million. Uh, well, 70 Catholics. Million. Yeah, in, in total. Not, not all black people. Right? <laughs> Very lost individuals. But you're worried about those black people too? Because black lives matter? Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 